Hey guys, Ryzen here. And Liz. Welcome to the recap of the supposedly a football game, but I think only one team showed up. It sure as hell wasn't the Chargers. Um, dear God. Dear God. So the Patriots win 45-0, despite not being very good all year. Um, I know the Chargers are 3-8, and eight, but they were a pretty decent 3-8 and eight team. Uh, they actually had lost most of their games by one score. This game was just Ooh. on another level of ridiculous. <laughs> well, I'm telling you, it was over quarter two. The Patriots scored 21 points in the second quarter. Um, so let's name off all the things that happened in this game. I mean... A punt return touchdown. Blocked field a goal. blocked field goal. Two interceptions. A near punt return touchdown. A second later. time. <laughs> a bunch of ridiculous punts by Bailey. Oh my god. A bunch of sacks. Offense able to move the down Chargers, the field. The Chargers missed a field goal. Defense playing out of their mind. Uh, Winovich getting... Winovich getting an interception. Yes, Winovich. You know, the defensive lineman. <laughs> At the end of the game, Stidham threw a touchdown. Stidham threw a touchdown to Gunner. Gunner scored, it, or is responsible for 17 of their points. Yeah, I know. <laughs> he scored more, more yards. He has more yards than the whole offense. Yeah. He single-handedly dominated this game. Oh boy! I mean, if you're the Chargers, you have to fire anybody oh, who coached you, your first year coach. Everyone. Your first year's coach. Oh my God, they are bad. And here's we figured out why. I, so here's why the special teams was so bad. Uh, at least, at least for the punts. So the first punt that they did, they had 12 guys on the field. The second one, they had 10 guys on the field. That's why Gunner scored. Now, 11 against 10, you're putting yourself at an unfair disadvantage that you create. You can play with 10 guys if you want. Sure, you, go you, ahead. You can put five guys out there if go you ahead, want. Go ahead, have fun. You're not going to go well. But you can. Um, then they brought 12 guys on the field for the next punt. Mm, whoops. I got, gave the Patriots a first down on that one. Uh, in fact, they, had, they actually had uh, 10, sent a guy on late, then sent another guy on late, making it 12. And then it was funny because the guy they sent on late was kind of like, no, that can't be right. Yeah, they saw it on camera. He's like, wait a he's second. Like, oh, no, <laughs> I'm number 12. I'm like, oh, yeah. Yeah, that's great. And then the, then the, then the last punt, they had 10 guys again. This has probably been the wow. best game to watch since the Falcon Super yeah, Bowl. It's been the most complete game that the Patriots have played. This season. They were great on offense. Cam Newton's stats are, are amazing, but but Don't solid, solid game. They had a good game. Um, had one near interception, but that, I mean, the game was over anyway. The defense totally, totally oh, confused Herbert. Or yeah, Hebert, however you Herbert, pronounce his name. The, the stunts. Man, he, he couldn't, he couldn't Bill just tortured them. the pressure <laughs> packages right all day. The, or the protection packages, he couldn't get it right all game. Man. It really confused him. The uh, offense started doing some, uh, what were those, Wildcats? Yeah, they did some Wildcats this game, uh, where Newton motioned outside and they ran uh, Harris at the middle. So look for Harris to throw the ball one of these games. We think it's going to happen. Uh, it's going to happen. It's going to be one of those, you know, lob things, uh, probably close to the end zone. Yeah. Uh, look for that, because that, that, that's, that's clearly in the playbook. I mean, I mean, the Patriots drives, touchdown, punt, 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 uh, no, touchdown, punt, touchdown. <laughs> then the blocked field goal return, touchdown. Which was returned by Devin McCourty. Yeah. Uh, the Patriots got a touchdown uh, in the third quarter. Then they punted. Another guy who field had goal. a really good day game was uh, Cody Davis on yes, special, teams. special teams. He got, saved one of the punts. Got, and Two he, of the and punts. he got the block. Yeah, right. He blocked that uh, punt. They had, instead of had a touchdown to Gunner, 38 yard touchdown, too, wasn't it? Oh, and then that was basically the end of the game. Um, here, let's read you the, uh, the the Chargers' drives. Missed field goal, punt, punt, punt. Blocked field goal return for a touchdown. Uh, interception, interception, punt, turnover on downs, turnover on downs, turnover on downs. Yeah, J.C. Jackson got and an interception 
And Chase Winovich got the interception. And Jackson at one point towards the end of the game landed ankle. funny. We think he twisted his ankle. He looks fine. But uh, they uh, two of those punts were one was a touchdown and one was almost a touchdown. So Gunner yeah. probably has like what two hundred oh, yards God. alone in this even, game. I don't even know if I can look up. Let's see. Punt. He was so close to breaking the Patriots' uh, record. Yeah, he missed it by like ten yards. Uh, kickoff returns. I'm looking at the wrong team. I know I am. Oh, uh, I do want to give credit to Kenneth Murray of the uh, on the Chargers. He was the one guy on the team that I thought the Chargers played extremely well. He was fantastic. Got kids, 12, got, kids got a good 12 future. tackles, two assists, a sack, two tackles for a loss. He was great. He was blowing up the backfield constantly. He was good. He was a nightmare for the Patriots to deal with. Joe Bosa did nothing. Yeah, Bosa didn't do much. He actually did get uh, flagged at one point for uh, roughing. Not really his it fault. It wasn't really he got roughing. Kinda, he got kind of pushed into him. I mean, but I mean... It's the way it goes. You're still responsible for your own body. That's the rules. So, well, you know, Bose is a classy guy. So, yeah, Newton, 12 of 19 for 69 yards. Stidham was 2 of 3 for 61 yards. <laughs> Both had a touchdown. Mm -hmm. Damian Harris, 16 carries, 80 yards, 5 uh, average. Very good. Even Newton, 14, 48 yards. Newton did score 4. two touchdowns on two offense. Two rushing touchdowns, yeah. Plus, he had the, the throwing one. Um, and Moncrief had a great uh, jet sweep in this game. Yeah. So even Michelle had a few good runs in this game. He so did. not not bad at all. The whole team uh, played well. Yeah, you know, Gunner. Harry caught a touchdown. Yeah, Harry caught a touchdown. A great one. A great one. He boxed he finally used his size in the end zone to box the guy out for a touchdown. It was a good play. That's what he should be doing. Yep. Um yeah, Gunner played well. Obviously Gunner's probably player of the game. Oh yeah, for sure. Uh, in fact the whole special team should have but Gunner specifically was excellent. Uh does it list the punt returns? Yeah. Uh, three returns, a 48.3 average, <laughs> and 70-yard uh, long. Uh, so they, the, the stat that I saw was that, so Gunner had... They had this listed incorrectly. He did score a touchdown. Yeah, he did score a touchdown. So he averaged, he had three returns over 60. I think he had 145 yards The total. entire NFL, up until this game, had two returns over 60. Yeah, he, he dominated this For punts. I so, mean... He almost broke the Good team blocking record. too. And that second punt return he almost scored on, that was mo that was a lot of him. It was. Because he reversed direction on that one. Yeah. That was great. Uh, I, I told you I liked him. Hundred and, you didn't uh, like him last year. So he got 180 yards total basically, 185 or Ish. so. Uh, Ridiculous. Total. He had a great game. Jesus Christ. I don't know uh, what was in the water in LA this week, but man. Chargers clearly weren't drinking it. And Folk made all his extra points. I know he had a lot of extra points for him to kick in this game. Yeah, Bailey's punts were... Oh, Bailey was fantastic. As usual. Um, he basically blocked. He basically punt penned them down at the 5 I ten, can't really name anybody on the time. Patriots who was... Bad? There was nobody bad in this game. The whole team was Myers good. dropped one pass, but then made up for it with a good, pa good catch later. This is the team we've been waiting to see all season. Well, this is an example of what happens when you have, at the end of the day, good coaching, good scheming. Um, versus a team that just doesn't scheme well. Right. They don't coach well. My voice is actually dead from screaming so much. So. In excitement. You know? I mean, Patriots don't have a lot of talent, but they do have the best coach in football, and he can take a terrible They have team. some of the best running backs. The, the, the okay. best running backs right now, so. Well, I don't think the Patriots are terrible, but they, they are probably below average talent-wise. Yeah, for sure. But he can make them into an average to above average team. And so, that's not bad. So... The next game is on Thursday against the Rams, and right now it's a giant question mark because of California's California shut looming down. shutdown. Yep. So we don't know what's going to happen. They're supposed to play in LA, but uh, same stadium. I don't know. We'll find but out. I'm, I'm, that game will be much harder. I'm guessing California's going to shut down, and they're probably going to go over to like Arizona or something. I don't know. Probably. I don't um, know. Actually, yeah. can they? Because the Arizona. The 49ers are already over there right now. Yeah, I don't know. What I don't doing. know what they're gonna do. Um, so Pedro's still in the hunt. Can they make the playoffs? Yes. They need a lot of things to go their way. Um, but I'll be happy if they win eight, nine games. You know. Yeah, the Dolphins need. They need to beat the Dolphins in two. Yeah, we need two the Dolphins weeks. to lose. And, and, and two weeks on Sunday. I think that's our best bet is get is the Dolphins start losing and uh, we beat them and and get their spot and sneak in. That's our best bet. But whatever, you know. They're not in, they're not in. Not in, they're not in. It's a fun, fun, fun team. Today's time. game was oh, great. I loved it. Yeah. So, uh, complete game. Great special teams play. 
Great off, great defensive play. Man, if you put, if you put play. money on this game or you had a uh, gunner on the, in your um, fantasy league, man. Yeah, they just were underdogs in this game, which I'm shocked by. Really? You thought the, ch the, the charge? I mean, I... Whatever. But man, if you had Gunner on your fantasy team as a punt returner, I mean, When have the Patriots ever, like, gotten creamed by a rookie quarterback? I mean, they've lost a few times to rookie quarterbacks, but not usually not, with Belichick. Usually they dominate. This was the Chargers' worst loss in team history as yes, well. Yes, it was their worst loss in team history. Uh, on, on another note of, of a disastrous loss for a team, Seattle lost to the Giants. Yep, they did. So that's bad. That's bad. The Giants probably have repped up that division now because they, they were not really expecting to win that game. That's really funny in my mind. Oh. They're probably gonna. They're probably gonna win seven games. Um, They'll go seven and seven eight, and nine. Seven and nine, whatever. Which is not horrendous for a division winner. And it's not good, but it's better than six and ten. True. If they if they actually manage that, I think six wins is enough to win that division. But whatever. It's gonna be a weird playoff year. Yeah, we'll see. Um, so hopefully we can beat the Rams next week. I think it's a Thursday game. It's supposed to be um, on Thursday. Yeah. We'll see. Should be good. Uh, that's gonna be a lot harder. But, uh, you know, anything's possible. It's Ryzen. And Liz. Thanks for hanging out with us, and uh, see you for the next recap. Okay. Bah! What are you doing? <laughs> That's terrible.